With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. For the question, for the reaction PCL5, you get PCL3 and Cl2. Supposing at constant temperature, okay, the temperature is constant and if the volume is increased 16 times the initial volume, the degree of dissociation for this reaction will become, okay, how much? That we have to calculate. So, four options are given. Let us choose the correct option. Now, we all know that degree of dissociation is inversely proportional to square root of pressure. Okay? Degree of dissociation that is alpha is inversely proportional to square root of pressure. Okay. Root of. Now, let us consider the ideal gas equation that is PV is equal to NRT. Okay, the ideal gas equation PV is equal to NRT. PV equals N. We know that temperature is constant, it is given there, temperature is constant. So, therefore, P is inversely proportional to volume. Okay. P is to volume. Let us consider this as the one. Let us consider this equation as one and this one as the second equation, two. Now, considering these two equations, we derive at the equation that degree of dissociation that is alpha is directly proportional to square root of volume. So we can write now alpha 1 by alpha 2 equals square root of v1 by v2. Okay, square root of v1 by v2. Now, let us write the values that is substitute the values for v1 and v2. v1 is the initial volume. Okay. So, what is the initial volume? We can take the initial volume as v. So, what will be v2? As per the question, it is 16 times the initial volume. So, v2 will become 16 v. Okay. 16 V. Now let us substitute this. So square root of V by 16 V. Okay. Now this when we solve you get 1 by 16. Okay. Because if we consider volume as um, initial volume as 1 then it will be 16 square root of this. So, let us remove the square root. When we remove the square root, you get 1 by 4. Okay. So, this is alpha 1 by alpha 2. So, if we take the equation as alpha 2 by alpha 1, then what do we get? You get the answer as 4. So, 4 times that is the degree of dissociation for this reaction will become 4 times. That is the answer. Okay, This is the answer. Let us now look into the options. First option itself is the correct answer 4 times. Okay, If this is A, the A option is correct and all the other options are wrong. I hope all of you have understood. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.